gracious me! By slaughtering thousands of innocent souls, they are creating a pure life stream in order to trick the planet into thinking the end is near. Yeah! Why, those conniving? I don't know what this Vice character is trying, but he's crazy if he thinks we're gonna let him get away with it! Right. Omega is being revived deep beneath Midgar in Mako Reactor Zero. To increase the output of Reactor Zero, all the other reactors have been tied into its mainframe. Our objective is to destroy 1 through 8 and slow the reanimation process. Mission details for each squad will be relayed separately. All right. We've still got some time before the big show. You got anything needs tending to do it? Okay, well, the only thing we've got left to do, we didn't check one door. I don't know what's down there. Or what we missed by not going down there first. Is it down here? Yeah. Hey guys, I guess I When I was talk still to you. a kid, I wanted to be in Soldier. But those men and women in deep ground. They're nothing like the guys in the poster I had on my bedroom wall. But you know, I wonder if they wanted to be in Soldier, just like me. Hey, I'm not going soft or anything. I'm ready for action. I hope you are. Sir! Good talk. Where the hell are we now? You gotta save yourself. Sir! I ain't no hero, sir! I ain't got what it takes to save the world! Not like you did, sir! But I'm ready to fight! And I know that there's somebody out there who needs me to fight for them and their freedom! And that's why I don't mind taking second stage to the heroes of this story! Heroes like you! I'll do all that I can, and I'll do my best, sir! Good for you. Around here then. Our enemy. The deep ground soldiers. They were all once just like us. They all had families, friends, even feelings. So, why did it ever have to come to this? What compelled Shinra to commit such hideous deeds? Now, these once normal people continue to kill. Because it is all they know. Are they solely to blame for their actions? No, I'm not condoning what they do. I will never forgive them for the terror they have instilled in the hearts of my brothers. They're our sworn enemy, and that will never, ever change. But I'm not fighting simply to end their lives. I'm doing it to end the chaos that they started. Want to say anything? No. Hello. Can I not speak to you? It's not much longer until the Midgar offensive begins. The last time I saw action was back during the liberation of Edge, where my entire squad was wiped out by that bloodthirsty Crimson soldier. The only reason I survived was because I fled from the area when I saw my companions fall. But not this time. I finally realized that there are some things in this world that are worth dying for. Good for you. Uh, I'm a bit confused on where I've come from now. Have you been in here? No. Mr. Valentine! Our troops are conducting their final preparations for the assault. I I've been ordered to not let anyone pass, sir! Let me pass or I'll kill you! Uh, you you're fine. I didn't want to go in there anyway. So I should just leave this door. Ah, the old engine room. 
While this airship is named after Sid's wife, construction of the vessel wasn't performed by the captain at all. Our team of loyal scientists here at the World Regenesis Organization, or those criminals at Shinra, weren't involved either. So that's what WORO stands for? I guess they were just saying WORO. To tell you the truth, the ship is not even from this era. It is a relic from a lost civilization. Most of the machinery in the engine room is boxed up in black casing, so we don't even know what half of it does. Oh, no, 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 no. There's no need to worry. Even though we cannot reproduce the technology, we can still put it to good use. I can almost guarantee there will be no problems. Almost. Sure. <laughs> Before we get to Midgar, I'll have this baby purring like a kitten. Hmm, I hope I'm not petting her the wrong way. Yeah, that's how you lose an eye. Well, good luck with that. Let's get out of here. That's everywhere then. We look at the map. We can't get into the other room apparently. Unless we get sent there in a minute, but. Let's get out of here. Let's commence this mission already. And we've had our exploration. Hey, you think? Still looking good there. Come in. Some old photos there, look. Pretty sure that's like the photo that has Ares on it. That like top one. When she's looking at it. There's Rocket Town as well. Pictures of inside the rocket. Can't quite see what the left one is under the other ones. Maybe more rockets. It looks like more rocket things. Pretty sure you can actually see Ares in there, maybe. Maybe. I literally like concept art or whatever. Vince, don't worry about the reactors. We'll take care of them. You work on those four wackos. I don't like letting you have all the fun, but... You know, I can't leave my baby here alone. Cloud and the others will be shutting down the power. And there's no way we're letting Yuffie go down there by herself. Sorry, buddy. Looks like from here on out, it's Vince versus the Sphinx. We're counting on you, old pal. You know, it's just occurred to me who we haven't actually seen yet out of the gang. Where's Red 13? He's the only one. Right, well, I'm good to go. So... What am I doing? How do I restart this shit? Yeah, but just look at Kate. I mean, Reed. When the hell did he become so important? All this you see around you, everything here, he put up the gill for it. Of course, that's on the condition that I help him save the world. <laughs> what I want to know is where he got that kind of cash. Probably the Shinra bank accounts. When all this is over, how about we grab a couple of cold ones? Just like the good old days, huh? Even Cher has been worried about you. Man, you know how she gets. <laughs> When all this is over, how about we grab a couple of cold ones? Yeah, okay, yeah, you said this. And that's his dialogue exhausted. Sir, I've been spending time analyzing the date deep grab. It used to be a military however. Yeah, you said this before. However, fine. Okay, nothing new from you guys then. I guess we'll go wander elsewhere then. You okay there, Yuffie? Did you hear? They get 
attacked Wu Tai as well. Thanks to my dad and the Wu Sheng, things didn't turn out as bad as they could have, but. But I'm worried about my old man. He's not as young as he used to be. He's gonna have a heart attack one of these days. If not, give me one. Now, if I was there, Dad wouldn't even have to put down his my tongue. What? What? <laughs> I could take out Deep Brown with one hand tied behind my back. Ha ha! Ha ha! Yeah, right after you finish throwing up. Yep, okay, that's your dialogue exhausted. Now let's see what's back this way then. Anything we've missed. Preview, change seat. So, no costume today. <laughs> Headquarters was pretty much destroyed by the deep brown forces. But I was able to salvage a few things. Number seven, nice to meet you. How does it work? How do you control it? Tell me, Reeve. Huh? Who's backing your operation? Oh, what? <laughs> Actually, I'm not sure. I've only met with a representative. However, the WRO is crucial for this planet's survival. I'm not concerned with the reasons this person has for helping us. As long as he continues writing checks. Though... I have a feeling it is probably someone who believes he is in debt to the planet. Yeah, like Rufus, maybe? Though, I mean, he probably had a lot of money to begin with, but he can't be making any more money since Shinra is, you know, kaput. Vincent, do you should probably think of getting some rest. Things are gonna get really nutty. Is that it? Vincent, yep. Okay. I'm ready to go, guys. I don't know what you guys are playing at. Let's see what was around this way. Back into the med bay. <sighs> so tired. Vincent Valentine. What? This feeling, is this what you meant? By doing something for someone you care about? <laughs> it seems so. Dr. Crescent's data has begun defragmenting within my mind. I can see many different images. Images she experienced with you, interference, recovery. So, so tired. Well, good night, I guess. Nothing else to say, no. Hmm, <laughs> what 
one next. Is that everything, do we think? We head back to the bridge. Oh, we don't need to head back down into the underground bit. Underground bit. The, the lower part of the ship. It's not underground. That makes no sense. Can't interact with the world map or anything, no? Anything you need to say? And all this is over. Nope, same thing. Thanks, Sid. Uh, I guess we can head back downstairs, see if we can get into that other room. That was blocked off, maybe? <laughs> maybe they're ready now. Who knows? There's been a very story heavy few episodes. Which is not necessarily a bad thing. A simultaneous attack from land and air. Hmm. I think they may be serious this time. They had better be. I've been so bored lately. His awakening is near. Let tonight be the final chapter. Vincent Valentine. What's this? Your phone. I retrieved it in calm. I've modified it slightly. Just dial pound V-I-N to contact my personal terminal directly. From this workstation, I can perform a synaptic net dive into almost any network system in Midgar. I may also be able to help guide you into deep ground. It's not what you think. By monitoring your movement, Dr. Crescent's data fragments are restored within me. I'm simply providing this service for my own benefit. 
I didn't say anything. I, uh, anyway, my resources here are limited. Do not expect too much. Hmm. I'm counting on you, Shulk. Uh, uh, I, it's just, I've never actually been counted on by anyone before. Uh, uh, never mind. Well then, can I count on you to keep an eye on the airship while we're away as well? Huh? I have already witnessed your strength and skill once. This is war, and we have to be ready for anything. Your assistance would be of great help. My assistance? Exactly. Commissioner! Ah, excuse me. Vincent, I will see you again before deployment. And Shell, remember, I'm counting on you. Oh. Fighting for. No one. No one to fight for. No one at all. This is it! Go! Away. Secondary squad, prepare for drop. Damage to the Shara minimal. Damn! They're gonna pay for that! <laughs> <laughs> 